If you guys come to the channel often, you know that my NVIDIA N1 exhaust install has almost 2 million views and is the most popular video on my channel by far. And the backlash of that was the insane amount of Instagram messages, Facebook messages, Snapchat messages, Facebook comments, Facebook messages, YouTube comments. Do I buy the N1 right now because I have $540 cash ready or do I save up another $500 and spend $1,035 on the Tomei? I waited this long to make this video because I wanted to own both exhausts and have a true understanding of the differences and have very valid input on which is better, which is worth the money because Nvidia has such a good rep. I was like, I don't know, I really gotta own both of them. Reminder, I had the N1 non-resonated. The Tomei has a small resonator on it in the middle. If I were to do it again, I would have bought the N1 with a resonator. You get the same tone and on the freeway, it takes out that drone. When I bought the non-resonated, it was great for 0 to 40 around town, but I got on the freeway, unequal length header, two different sound tones, it makes a rumble sound, that's what does it, there's two different tones bouncing back and forth. And we're on the freeway at about hour three with the non-resonated one, it's like a whoa, 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 like this on your ears, and it just hurts at like hour three and you have a headache. I love cars so much, I didn't get mad, I didn't lose my patience, I just knew it would get better one day. The Tomei, I put it on, Titanium is more of a dense material. It had more of an echoey sound and it added it took a very low Sound that the Subarus make and made it a little bit higher pitch and made it Just that much more aggressive and I was super stoked on that because 0 to 40 It was even louder than the N1 non resonated But then when I got on the freeway it toned it down a little bit and the tone is a little bit higher pitch So it's not as hard on your ears in the lower end of like bass sound so it didn't make like the back of my neck hurt or anything like that like the N1 would, N1 would after you know three hours of road tripping without a resonator. So $540, $1,035. If I were to do it completely over again, I would wait and buy the Tome and be done with it. That is the best exhaust in my opinion. I have all the sound clips after this, but the N1 is a great option if you want something quick, you can sell it later. And the one thing I do visually like about the N1 better is when you're looking from the rear and it's the right exit, you see the pipe come out and then curve to the right and then go out. So when you're like about 100 feet away from the car, you see this like really shiny pipe, you know, under the car and it looks trick. But the tip on the Tomei looks better and it's just a better sound for my taste. I also need to mention that the Tomei is a lot straighter of an exhaust since it's a left exit. It's pretty much straight back out of the car. And in the first couple thousand RPM, you can literally feel the difference in back pressure and the cars, how the way it revs is a little bit smoother. It's a little breeze that much more. And that one one curve in the N1 does make a difference. And also the Tomei pops, bangs, everything flames way more than the Nvidia N1 does. And I think that's because it's so much straighter and maybe it has to do with titanium, I'm not sure. So there's that, I'll let you guys decide for yourselves. And now you'll know kind of what to do and what to spend, but I would save up for a thousand by the Tomei, it sounds.